Hello and welcome to the Coffee Cup tutorial. This is a combination of the image mapper. I'm going to show you an introduction to that uh, little piece of software and how to get that image mapper uh, graphic onto your visual site designer. So it's a combination of those two. So uh, let's pull up the image mapper. Uh, it's a wonderful little program, like I said. I've had it for many years. And uh, you can use it on any kind of graphic or photograph, so long as it has these formats, a GIF, a JPEG, or a JPG, and a PNG, or a PNG. So any of those, so you can um, click Next, and then you can browse your hard drive for your photograph or your graphic that you would like to use for this, to make this image map. So I've gone to my pictures, and I, many years ago I had to do the counties in Wisconsin for my job, uh, make an image map, and so I will use that since I have that handy. Um, so we just double click that, open it up, and we go next. And there's the name of our map that we're going to be using, so that's good. We're going to go next, and as soon as that finishes, now, as you can see, you have your, uh, uh, your graphic up here, which in this case is my map. Now, you will notice that up here on the left-hand side, you have a design and a preview tab, uh, just like in your uh, visual site designer. And also, beneath that, you will see that you have some shapes. You have the rectangle, a circle, and a polygon. Now, as you can tell, most uh, maps, the, especially on this um, counties, they're, they're not all rectangular, they're not all square, whatever. Now this one would be rectangular, uh, but you can, if you have something that you want to really get the uh, exact um, outline of, you use your polygon. And how you use your polygon is you come, let's come over here. You place it where you want to start, and you click once with your left mouse, button and then you just drag and I don't know if you can see that but wherever you feel that that is to stop you click again now if this is too small for you you can always um, zoom in and you have to kind of um, mess with it a little bit but here we are so um, let's try that again. Okay, here, laying laid. Okay, we're going to start there and come over here and over here and over here. And you're just clicking your butt, your left mouse button every time you come to a place where you have to change directions. Okay, and so on. And I'm almost done. And there we go. And now, if you, as you can see, I didn't, when you get to the end, double click your left mouse button. And then it becomes, um, let's go of it. Now you can see I got out of um, lines a little bit because I'm hurrying. But you can just grab any of these little boxes and make your adjustments uh, just like that so that you can get it exactly like you want it to be. All right, so then um, we're going to come over. I want to show you the rectangle tool. And the same way, you put it on where you want to start. Click once on your left mouse button. Drag. And there we go. So I'm going to do Taylor. I went and clicked on the inside. Now, if you come over here to the um, right-hand side of your screen, you will see Area Properties. In there, you put... Um, your name and um, then your URL which would be taylor.html okay and then we're going to have some mouse over text but I will continue that and I will see you on the next video thank you for watching